What did we learn last episode? We should go out and injure old people. Put them out of work. Preferably those who work with the young kids. Preferably those who take a loss to taking the young kids. Why? I guess we can renovate their place and make it even better. Easy. Making our losses into a game. Brilliant. Um, aside from that, we got to see like good moments of like Nagisa being like a sensei. Reaching out to the kid Sakura. That was nice. And then... Was there some Asano stuff? No, that was the episode before that, right? I think we were leading into something else, though. I can't remember. Let's begin today's reaction. Presents. Oh, that's right. We got new drip. That's what was like the last, you know, bit of last episode where everyone got like new drip. We kind of like ruined Koto Sensei's barbecue and shit. I mean, I think a lot of people would have enjoyed Beach Sensei's design. I don't think he cares about love. He's too busy with this job. Beach Sensei birthday? Beach Sensei birthday? Oh shit! Megu, Kataka Megu, I got no clue like that is. Sugar daddies. Yeah, Karasuma is not a sugar daddy. <laughs> Any gift not from him is just worthless junk. Yeah, because those presents don't matter. It's about what that gift symbolizes. No one cares after you get the first luxury bag. Who cares if you get another fucking Gucci bag? If it's not from Karasuma, it's, there's no point. Loboro Sensei is dead. The Reaper showed up, right? That's Megu, I see. Megu was the girl where other girls were like confessing to her. Mm, I think the girls are gonna be nice to Bitch Sensei because it was her birthday. Okajima. But Karasuma has to buy a gift to her. Exactly. It's not about the gift. It's the person that gives the gift and the message that it sent. It has to be Karasuma. Damn, we're broke. Hmm? You watched last episode with us? <laughs> he did. For a teacher. Oh, a rose. Why are flowers still popular go-to gift? I think it's just a legacy product. You hold like flowers, rose, you know, the chivalry of a man giving a girl like a bunch of bouquet of flowers. Straight up just getting carried by nostalgia. What is the fucking utility function for a flower in this modern day? You're just describing the flower though. Yeah, yeah, see the instinctual level. I think the instinctual level, right? This shit's just fucking legacy. Nostalgia, it's the culture, the society formed on it. <laughs> My man's just trying to get the bag. Alright. <laughs> We're basically just stalling here, I think. Yo, what the fuck is Okajima doing right now? <laughs> he's already taking pictures, bro. The sound he's making. Sus. Yeah. Poor bitch sensei. You're very popular today only because it's, this is all an act. But... It's an act out of love for Beach Sensei. They want to do something nice for her. Yo, Okajima getting the nice angles. Here we go. Karasuma, you gotta give it to her. You're so dense. <laughs> Holy shit. That <laughs> Bitch Sensei, you said that bitch. Okay. Prep okay. Alright, we're good to go. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Just make her start playing fucking piano and everything. Bye now. We're leaving. Bye. Don't worry, it's all prep. No, 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 no. Wait for it, wait for it. Oh. Irina. Oh shit, Irina. <gasps> oh. Wow, he remembered? No, he didn't. He <laughs> would have never fucking known if he was with the kids, man. Oh. 
Yeah. Oh. <laughs> what a way to fucking kill the mood, huh? First and last birthday together, she. Koro sensei might just destroy the world, you're right. You never know what the world, you know? So you're saying when the mission is over, like, there is nothing beyond that, bro. Just. Brother, you are just. Ugh. He's too focused on his job. He's too focused on his mission. He doesn't even understand the implications of his words. Because maybe he actually does, and he doesn't even think, you know, bitch sensei like that. Either he's super, super, super stupid about this shit, or he just doesn't give a fuck. Yeah. The kids set this set up. You know. Claire? Bro hasn't <laughs> What the fuck? Kuro sensei was ready to take all the fucking pictures too. Yeah, they meant good. Octorazzi. Oh. He's closing her heart off. Oh, take your flowers back. She shut herself in. Karasuma, you fucking idiot! Wah, wah. She's done with you kids. I'm not like you understand. Oh, he just never gave a fuck. Or this is what he actually wants to like close her off and like, you know, push her away. For the mission. Man. I mean, the, 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 the fucking world is at stake, guys. Like, like, the world could blow up. Like, this is not a joke. So I totally understand what he's saying, but damn, bro. You wouldn't... Like, don't you think she might be even more productive if she was feeling good? Like, dulling her blade with romance? What if it could sharpen it? What if she could get, like, enlightened, euphoric, she feels happy? I don't know. It's all business to him, huh? Yeah, crap Suma, bro. It's too hard to say. Can't even say crap Suma. Oh, Reaper. That's not our sensei. That's Reaper, maybe. The episode will be about the Grim Reaper taking Bit Sensei and Karasuma saving her, and at the end he'll carry her out like a fucking knight in shining armor with her with his princess, and then everything will be good, is my prediction. Let's soccer ball today. <laughs> you play soccer? Oh, you talk. <laughs> Sambai. Not quite sure what our brand of soccer is. Okay, sure. She wouldn't. Oh, the flower guy! Where'd she come from again? The fuck? Is he the Green Reaper? No, no, no. What are we doing right now? Why is he here? Why the fuck is he here? How does he know of this place? Hello? Is he the Grim Reaper? Wait! Wait! Exploit? Research? Oh. Yeah, dude, what the fuck? Oh, shit. The flower. God, that's crazy. That last episode, they showed a Grim Reaper. He's just working as a flower man. And it's just a young dude. He's an Ikemen. I thought it'd be some old dude. Yeah. What's the lesson? Don't buy flowers? Shiota Nagisa time. It's Nagisa's moment this part. This is actually crazy. Oh, Yuchi got an email. Which is just something. It's gonna be sensei. It's gonna be bit sensei. Why did you strip her though? <laughs> There's no need to strip her clothing down like this. 
Oh, damn, yo, he's drawing. Yo, he's not even drawing. He's, he's, not, he's not even looking while drawing right now, bro. Look, look. Yeah. Pass the situation. Okay. Oh, cut up. Yo, he's scaring me. Oh, shit. Because he's not scary, he's scary. The way that he's so nonchalant about this, he's so unthreatening, but it's terrifying. That kind of low key is Nagisa, too, to an extent. I think Nagisa is a great description for that, too. Yo, Terasaka, careful. Bossy bitch. Yo, he's a professional, man. He knows our names. Yeah. So cool. Did he disappear? He disappeared. He disappeared with the fucking flag. <laughs> that is so cool. Dude, the Reaper's entrance is like the sickest thing I've seen in this show, maybe. That was actually just so casual. So cool. Just casually just walks in. Hey guys. And everyone's like, yo, flower guy. And everyone's like. The fuck? Hello, I'm the Reaper. And then the flower, bro. He just disappeared into the air. Uh, I don't know. What's his goal? What is the Reaper's goal? Well, he's an assassin. Koro-sensei is a target. Well, he, he I mean... Is this a is this like vengeance against like Irina and her sensei? I don't know. I thought that maybe he was showing up to like take Beast Sensei hostage and then also take the kids hostage and use them as leverage against Koro Sensei to kill Koro Sensei. But I got no clue. This feels like personal shit with Beast Sensei, or maybe this is all a red herring and this is the ultimate lesson and he's here to enrich us of assassination techniques. I don't know, man. The Shinigami. So cool, bro. Koro Sensei is conveniently in Brazil, too. He can't help us out. Maybe he can help us out by then. Maybe, yeah. <coughs> oh, the new gear. Our drip. Man, we got drones now, not just RC tanks. ピーパー。約束は<笑><笑> Okajima being disrespected, but honestly, he's asking for it. Oh, oh, oh. oh shit, we got a plan? Did we get out? Not bad? Okay, okay. Oh, what was that? The Shinigami. This is fun for him. It is actually terrifying how he's just so chill about it. Before Takaoka, right, he would just always just show how evil he was. But this guy, it's scary because he's not scary. I'm like, ah! Brazil. What was that? What did they react that with? 7 to 1. I don't get it. Seven to one. And then a beam of light shows up out of nowhere. Oh, is this a meme? 
There was the uh, Pornhub video where it's just like Germany, Brazil, it was a fun title and it had to do with, you know, like a disgusting score. Yeah, so that's a reference to that. That's very meta. That's that's a while ago. Though. I don't even know how many years ago that was, but I, I do remember something so one-sided happening. That shit could have been like 10 years ago, man. Yeah, no, Germany defeated Brazil 7-1 in 2014. Yeah, that shit's literally fucking 10 years ago. Holy. How did Brazil lose so bad to Germany back then, though? Isn't Brazil supposed to be a land of soccer? Like, I know Germany is also, they're no joke, but like, such a big blowout. I wonder what happened that caused that. <laughs> bald, bald, bald. I think his toupee fell off or half. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Mitsu got hacked. Yo, the Reaper is so good at everything. <laughs> this is Mitsu's apartment, bro, looking like mine right now. She got her fucking laundry up, all the fucking trash and food and takeout boxes. Meet Mitsu. <laughs> this Mitsu is amazing. Uh oh. Is it really? Someone else. Wait a minute, he's like invisible. What the fuck is this? <laughs> it's just a visual thing. It's it's how they're perceiving. It's not that he's actually invisible, right? It's how they're perceiving. Oh my god, he's such a peak pro assassin. Look at that aura, I can't even see him. <laughs> yeah, for sure, bro. <laughs> Down. <laughs> Kimura dead. So Doro. Oh, Kaede. There is no need to do Kaede that dirty, bro. Holy shit, these kids are getting fucked up. But, but, but they, they all have the suit on, right? They all have their new drip, which, like, you know, is armor. Ooh. Nagisa getting serious, though. Oh shit, the main character's going in. Okay, okay. What are we gonna do? Do the fucking two things? You drop one and go like this? I don't think it's gonna work on the Reaper, man. Yeah, the clothing did take the impact. The soundtrack is so epic, though. Can you do it? Can you really? He used it on us. He used the fucking technique on us, bro. But I didn't even see his ass with two separate weapons. But he clapped. It's GG. The soundtrack being cut there. The triumphant soundtrack being cut with the clap is so good. Because you're just like, let's go, Nagisa. Woo. Sight. Get out of here. Dazed and confused. Nagisa couldn't do it. Wait, wait, wait. Karma, though. Karma, you got a plan? He does not have a plan. Nagisa's still stunned. Yo, he straight up kind of looks like the human god right now from Mishaku Tensei if he wasn't all white. Okay. Mind broken Nagisa. I expect Karasuma to show up. I feel like Kuro Sensei is on his way, but like thematically with the show being Beat Sensei and Karasuma, the romance going off, it just I feel like Karasuma has to show up, right? He's got a clutch for us, right? Terosaka and gang. Uh oh. She's tied up in such an erotic way. You jinxed it. Shouldn't have said that. Job's not over. Why'd you say that? Wah, wah. Wait, bitch, that's it? She's up. She got some weapons. What the fuck? She took us out? Wait, 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 wait. You telling me this is the true bitch, Sensei? 
that the one that we've seen so far was a fake one and the real killer has been sleeping all this time? What? Thanks to him? He fucking kidnapped you. He killed your sensei. All right, sure. Fucking do a 180. Maybe it's Kadasuma rather than, you know, uh, the Reaper. Anyways, I, it's an act, right? But she took the kids out. I don't know where we're going with this. Honestly, if I was called Bit Sensei for a half a fucking year, I would have probably killed these kids way faster than what she's doing right now. <laughs> Yo, bitch sensei crashing out! Ituna, take your take her out! Bitch sensei, you couldn't! You wouldn't! Minus 1000 aura right there. You just lost all the immersion. You can't be doing that shit. You had everything going, now it's fucking done. But you still took the kids out, that's crazy! You took out Terasaka there! Negative 1000 aura. Plus 1000 aura? Never mind, she back. It was a fucking act. What the fuck? This is a roller coaster. <laughs> My reach right now, like, like the the only way to like make sense of this is that she's doing this for the kids to knock him out so they're not in danger against the reaper. Maybe that makes sense. Ituna <laughs> story. Reaper. Yeah, you're grown ass fucking people in the professional fucking assassination industry. You're, com you're, you're making fun of middle school kids. Are you having fun? <laughs> the best fucking assassin, another fucking assassin, top tier, full grown ass adults beefing with middle school kids. Oh, I bet you're so proud. さて、いつかこっちが出る。絶望的な戦いに挑むか。さらさかしたわ。とてめえで叩きのめすぞ。幸福だ。おお。Maybe <笑> well, Kuro-sensei is at his weakest when he has things to protect, right? Whenever the kids are in danger, right? Kuro-sensei is a huge liability. Also, you can like tilt him and stuff like that. But I think that holding the kids hostage one by one, I think is one of the best ways to kill Kuro-sensei. In fact, my theory on like what the end game of this show will be is like the whatever big government groups, right? The coalition of people, you know, with this plan, I think they're going to be at their wit's end as they realize there's not enough time and, you know, the world's going to blow up. Fuck it. Let's just literally hold the world, you know, hostage. Let's nuke this world. If you're gonna blow up the world, let's just fucking blow up the world first. As in, like, take the kids hostage, and then Koro Sensei will then have to, like, sacrifice himself to prevent that situation to save the kids. Something along those lines is how I, like, think that this show will, like, end. Karasuma, where is he? Where is he? The goat, Karasuma, where is he? Karasuma got it? Karasuma, my goat, where is he? What the fuck? <laughs> okay, Koro Sensei is fucking wild and out today. If you're into this shit, I mean, I can't really blame you. <laughs> Koro Sensei is like, this is weird. You really rope like a dog right now to sniff for the kid. <laughs> oh, it's that way. Natural way. What the fuck is natural about this? Someone fucking saw this and they'd be like, what the way? What the kind of monster is that? <laughs> Koro Sensei's persona, bro. This is straight up Koro Sensei's persona. Koro Sensei's person. Yo, today's episode of Assassination Classroom is just on fire and, and two part, you know, um, arc, I think, right? Because we're not done with this yet. It's fucking sick. The. Setup. I thought that this is gonna be like a chill slice of life episode. Bit since his birthday, a little bit of you know romance going on with Karasuma, but no, it was all set up for the Reaper to show up to take Bit Sensei. But Bit Sensei, I, 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 I guess that she really feels like she wasted the last six last six months. Like she's like doing a lot of introspection thanks to Karasuma. No, I, I think that she'll fall as as soon as Karasuma like um, like. I think what Bitsense is doing right now is like she gets rejected once and she's like, oh men are trash, I'm a different girl now. And then as soon as Karasuma like shows her some affection next episode or something, I bet that she'll come right back to us. The Reaper's introduction was so hype. The nonchalant way that he just showed up 
and then just casually announce like the way that he disappeared too and even like foreshadowing with episode one of season two of like those that shouldn't be feared that are not you know scary are the ones that should be feared and stuff like that it's cool to tie in those themes and right now we're kind of cooked he brutalized every one of the kids even nagisa's like in you know, a clap technique nah bro he does it even better but can karasuma really do this Maybe. Karasuma and Koro-sensei, I think we can definitely trust them. That's it for me. If you're still here though, and if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for even more content. But until next time, take care.